First Club, the UK government's Minister for Legal Migration and the Border. An important part of my role is ensuring that our economy has access to the skills and expertise it needs to flourish and grow. Now, it's true to say that in delivering our immigration system, we have to balance the needs of business and the country as a whole. But it would be wrong to perceive the necessary measures we've taken to reduce net migration overall, as in any way suggesting that we're cutting ourselves off from talent. Whether for study or work, the UK is a highly attractive destination for the brightest and the best, and that's not going to change. We recognise the immigration system has an important part to play in ensuring we remain competitive in the global recruitment market. That's why we've established routes which focus on attracting those with the skills and talent to support the growth of our economy. For example, there's the global talent route for leaders and potential leaders in the fields of science and research and digital technology, as well as the arts. Those on the global talent route do not need a job offer or to be sponsored to take up employment. And recently published research showed that access to this visa influenced the decision of four in five global talent visa holders to apply to live and work in the UK. The high potential individual route gives a short term visa offer to recent graduates of the world's top universities, giving them the opportunity to build their careers in the UK without the need for a prior job offer. This ensures that employers have access to the most highly sought after international graduates, as well as to the pipeline of student talent from our universities to further enhance the UK labour force. These routes supplement our sponsored migration routes, such as the skilled worker and scale up routes, which enable UK employers to fill skill gaps through international recruitment. That hopefully gives you a flavour of some of the different routes and schemes that we deploy. And of course, we work closely on these issues with our colleagues across government, including in the Department for Business and Trade. We also regularly engage with businesses across a range of different sectors, and we very much appreciate the insight and expertise gleaned through those conversations. To sum up, my focus is on delivering a fair and effective immigration system which works in the interests of our country and our economy. There's a delicate balance to be struck. These are complex, challenging issues, and we always seek to weigh up all of the relevant factors in determining our approach. But the message is clear. The UK is unwaveringly committed to attracting the best overseas talent, and we greatly value the contribution that highly skilled migrants make to our society and our economy. Finally, let me just say thank you to the FT for giving me the opportunity to provide this message and I wish you all an excellent event.